It's Friday, July 8th. I'm Allie Hoxie with your headlines. The city of Detroit is reporting its first probable case of monkeypox. The city's chief public health officer made the announcement on Twitter last night. This is the second case of the virus in Michigan. The first case was reported in Oakland County last week. The number of cases in the U.S. has now grown to 700. And it's the end of an era in Royal Oak. The main art theater is in the process of being demolished. Chopper 7 flew over the theater as crews worked to remove the marquee from the historic movie house. Back in May, the Royal Oak City Commission approved plans to demolish the site to make way for a new five-story building with retail, apartments, and office space. And more relief at the pump for Metro Detroit drivers. Gas prices continue to trend downward. Overnight prices in Metro Detroit dropped down to $4.94 a gallon. That's a 13 cent drop from a week ago, but still well over last year's average of $3.29 a gallon. And across Michigan, drivers are paying an average of $4.85 a gallon. Last week, the state was still pushing $5 a gallon. Well, temperatures today rise into the low 80s, but we have to factor in a few afternoon showers, maybe even an isolated thunderstorm that quickly ends this evening dry for the weekend. Less humid, very comfortable. 80 on Saturday, low 80s on Sunday.